Welcome to the final tutorial in Module 1. In the previous tutorial we learnt how to add widgets to our blog sidebar. One of those widgets was a links widget. Here I am at my class blog. I actually have two blog roles on this blog. A blog role is a list of links, either internet sites or blog links. Today we will make a list of classmates blogs. You can have as many different blog roles as you like. They are defined by categories. On the right I have a blog role which has a category called Cool Places. This includes some neat internet sites. On the left I've made a blog role with a category called Learners. This is a list of all my learners' blogs. So, let's go up to James's cat's dashboard. The first thing we must do is make a list of categories which we can use as blog roles. So, follow me over to Links and click Link Categories. By default, Edge of Blogs gives us one blog role category called blog role. But we can add our own blog role categories so that we can have as many different links widgets as we choose. So I'm going to call this new link category cool places. I'm not going to write a description now. I might do that later. But we need to click add category. As you can see, the new category appeared on the right. I'm going to do one more link category and I'm going to call this one Class Mates Blogs. Alright, add category and this now appears on the list of categories on the right. You can add as many link categories as you wish. The next step is to add new links. So go over to links, click add new link, and here I am at the add new link page. On this page we can add some links that we want to appear on our blog roll. I'm going to add two different links today. The first one is going to be to my class website. So the first thing we need to do is give our link a name. This is what will appear on our blog. So I'm going to call it Mr. C's blog. Alright, now we need to write in the address for this blog. So I've typed in the title and the address. You have been given a list of other classmates blog addresses. These are the addresses that you will type in here. You will type in the classmate's name in there, in the top. Alright, the next step is to give this address a category. So, I'm going to click on Cool Places, because Mr. C's blog is a cool place. Click Add Link. Okay, now I can add another link. I'm going to add a classmate's link this time. My classmate's name is Darwan, and I'm going to put in her web address, and I am going to add her to my classmate's blog. I'm not going to put her in cool place because Darwan is a classmate, so I add the link. Alright, now that I've added my links, I need to go to my widgets and add the link widgets. So, I go to Appearance, Widgets. On the Widgets page, I'm going to open my right sidebar and I just want to check that this link says Blog Roll. OK. Save that. Close. Now, I need to add some more link widgets, one for each of my categories. So, I drag a link widget over put it there 
and I'm going to choose the category Classmates Blogs. Save. Close that. I need one more for Cool Places. Click that there. Choose Category, Cool Places, and Save. Close that. Now, I'm going back to my blog. And as you can see, down here on the right, I have one links widget with a category called blog role, one called classmates blogs, and one called cool places. However, I think my home page should actually go in cool places. So I'm going to change that. So I need to go and edit this link. So let's go back to our dashboard. Go to links and edit. I want to edit my home page. So hover over, click edit. I want to change the category from blog roll to cool places. Update link. Now when I go back and visit my blog, you can see that my home page is now under Cool Places. Alright, but I want Cool Places to appear on this left sidebar here. So I need to go back to my widgets, click on my right sidebar, take this widget and drag it up to my left sidebar. Here we go. Now I'll go back to my blog and as you can see on the left sidebar I have my cool places and on the right sidebar I have my classmates blogs. Now finally I've noticed that my category classmates blogs has a grammar error. It should be plural classmates blogs. So I need to change that. I'm going to go back to site admin. I'm going to go up to link, link categories. I'm going to go over to classmates blogs. And I'm going to click quick edit. And I can change the title in here and put the apostrophe at the end. Update category. And when I go back to the blog, you can see that it's changed and it's as easy as that.